So you want to hear school students talk about their travel experiences, learnings, escapades, episodes, knowledge, incidents from all the corners of the globe. Terra Talk, platform from where young voices reach out to the world. Brought to you by Edterra Adventures, committed to truly educational student travel. Salam, listeners. My name is Tejaswini. I study in 9th grade. Salamat Bagne. My name is Shori Joshi. I study in 6th grade. Salamat Bagne. My name is Anushka Vak. I am studying in 12th standard. I am Anj Bhutavit and I am studying in grade 6th. Salamat Bagne. I am Sia Jain. I study in class 7th of Vidhi International School to add a new staircase to the building of my dreams. Today, all 5 of us from Vidhi International School will share our 5 amazing experiences that we had at Genting Highlands. Terra Talk, a platform from where young voices reach out to the world. To start with, I would like to talk about the cable car ride which we took from Genting Bus Stand to First World Resort. We enjoyed a breathtaking view of the 130 million year old rainforest from the 10 minute cable car ride. The seats were very comfortable. There were two stations, Chingsvi Station and Sky Avenue Station. The rainforest was amazing and it was wrapped with lush green grass. The cable cars had transparent glasses which provided a perfect downhill view. The first station allowed us to explore the Chingsvi Caves Temple and its surroundings at no extra charge. On the second station, we visited various shops for buying souvenirs. If you come with your family or friends, then you can have a peaceful time chatting with them. And if you are traveling alone, then you can spend time doing some photography. I would like to tell you about the amazing deep park that is there inside the resort. Yes, you heard that right. Inside the resort, a group had a fun time at the Skytropolis theme park inside the mall. The entrance of the indoor theme park was great. It was decorated with enchanted lights as the Halloween festival has just gone by. The rides in the park were very scary and fascinating. My heart popped out of my chest and into my mouth when I saw the most scary ride in the park. The most fascinating ride was the dashing car. Everybody loved this ride. The outdoor park was still under the testing phase and alas, we couldn't enjoy it. But visitors would be able to enjoy it in the coming years, so everyone will look forward to your addition to this experience. Wow, what an amazing experience you guys had! But what I am about to share is close to everyone's heart because it's way go through the stomach. Are you attached to your food and want it even when you leave the country? Well, Genting Highlands got you covered with multiple variety of cuisines they have had to offer. To prove my point, the coffee terrace in the premises provides a range of local Malaysian, Chinese, Western, Japanese, Western Asian food, soups, beverages, and a desert section. The extensive sitting area makes it easier to accommodate more people to release their yummy food. A coordinating staff that cater to our specific needs if we had any, despite the self-service facility added to the delightful experience. The Indian restaurant that we visited during our dinner time also catered to the Jain population, which shows that Malaysia is open for all. To sum it up, a foodie traveler who wants to experience authentic Malaysian food will get the same level of enjoyment from the buffet as a person who would like to fulfill their desire of eating own delicacy. Awesome, Anushka. Now let me tell you my experience, which I had at the Genting Highlands. Oh, what a freezing experience it was at the snow world. Everyone had a whale of time playing with the snow. A smile is forming on my face while relieving those memories through this recording. Snow world is a part of the amazing Genting Highlands. The temperature maintained was around minus five degrees Celsius, and we were given layers of clothes to protect us from the cold. It was a welcome change from the hot and humid weather of Malaysia. Me and my friends enjoyed the snow fight and snow slide. There were igloos and a whole city town there. Even on the top was a castle complete with a king and his subjects. It was really cool, but my experience was the best. So now I would start with my exotic shopping experience in Genting Highlands. You can really get a vast area of cosmetics, bags, and accessories for the experience of shopping. Oh my goodness! How can I forget the mouth-watering chocolate shop? Actually, that was lip-magging. 
you can really get a good variety of chocolates in Malaysia. A shop named Mavic was actually big and the things were marvelous. It looked very interesting. There were many shops like that, especially the street shops. Apart from learning many new local words, meeting new people and visiting different places throughout our trip, we can confidently say that these five experiences at Genting Highlands would be closest to our heart for many decades to come. Thank you. Like what you're listening? Stay tuned for new podcasts on edterra.com slash terratalk.